Brian see me fight on Tanko. It might have been against James O'Connell. And then after the James O'Connell fight, Brian messaged me personally and said, um, listen mate, you were brilliant there tonight. Um, I would like to get you on uh, my, my show. And um, I was scheduled to fight Marcus Kalberg. I think, uh, Norwegian, I think he's Norwegian. I was meant to fight Marcus Kalberg on one of Brian's shows. Um, but I've done the ligaments in my in, in me right knee, so we had to pull out. Um, and then Brian got me on the next show then. And I think the next fight he got me was Rhys Thompson. Rhys Thompson, at the time, was number four in the UK, maybe. Or number three. I fought Reese. I drew with Rhys on Yoko. Um, it, was a, it, was, it was a close fight. Um, I think he was just a little bit too skilled for me at the time. Um, he just kept me long and made me uh, frustrated. After the Reese fight, my next fight on Yokow was Simon Forrest, which I got disqualified on. Um, you know, everybody knows why. I turned him and kicked him while he was on the floor a little bit too late. Um, but in the heat of the moment, when I turned him and kicked him, in my eyes it was one continuous motion. When I looked back, I was about five seconds too late. So there's no uh, denying that it was that it was a foul, um, and rightly so. I got uh, disqualified, and then so during that time, since the first time I fought Reese, Macaulay Coyle was number one at the time then, and then Reese Thompson fought Macaulay Coyle, beat Macaulay Coyle. So Reese Thompson was then number one. Um, Reese Thompson wanted the rematch with me because he believed he beat me in the first fight, um, which obviously worked in my favour as well because he was number one then and I got a, I got a shot at the uh, number one spot. So the third fight I think it was then on Yokel was for the number one spot against Reese Thompson. How did the fight fight they look on paper was a clash of styles against Reese? and because. He's a bit more technical. Yeah, yeah. Um, with with Reese, I think Reese um, underestimated me going into the second fight because he felt so comfortable in the first three rounds of the first fight until I changed the game plan and clinched him a little bit and used my strength to my advantage and managed to scrape a draw out of it. Reese weren't happy with that. So the second fight, I think he sort of um, underestimated me a little bit. Um, he's a top lad, Reese. I speak to him now. Still, he's 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 a, he's a good lad. Um, but I knew for the whole camp that I was gonna that I was gonna damage him. I I knew I knew for a fact. Um, there was just no nothing else. There was no other thought in my head but just tunnel vision. To I am going to like badly hurt Reese Thompson and become number one.